Hi, my name is Dr. Spencer Zimmerman. One of the most common questions I get with individuals who suffer concussions and traumatic brain injuries, why do I have neck pain? that seems to not respond to any of the treatment I do, whether they've gone to a physical therapist, a chiropractor, acupuncture, or massage. They may feel good initially when worked on, but then the results typically do not hold. And in some cases, it doesn't do anything at all. And then in about 10 to even 20% of cases I see, it can actually make them worse. So what is the cause of this neck pain? Now, the neck pain typically starts at the base of the skull, right there, and it goes down from there into your neck and then in between your shoulders. This is very frustrating and creates a lot of pain for the patients I see. And if you've got it, you know what I'm talking about and you're dealing with it as well. So why does this occur to begin? Well, it's really an issue with our brain feeling safe. If our brain does not feel safe, it uses the many reflexes in our neck to make us, to make it stable. Unfortunately, it causes us a lot of pain. So what are the things that can make us not feel stable? Well, our eyes are responsible for bringing in, bringing in a lot of input to our brain. So if our vision, if we've got blurry vision, problems with focus or concentration, if we can't track well, our brain says, hey, I don't trust this information coming in. And so in order to make you safe and make it feel safe, it locks down the mechanisms. Now, another reason for this is your balance system, specifically the part in your inner ears called your vestibular system. Damage to the vestibular system is very common in traumatic brain injuries and concussion. When this has been impacted, you'll also have those issues with your neck. Now, while you can have one or the other, most of the time you actually see both because they work hand in hand. For example, if you're walking, as you walk and take a step, every time your heel hits the ground, you get a little movement in your head and your eyes have to reflexively respond equal and opposite to that of your head. And so if those systems are not healthy together and they're not communicating the right way to your brain, the brain has no choice but to tighten up the neck muscles as a way to keep it self to feel safe. So that is why you have neck issues that seem to not resolve with any of the of the, of the care that you may receive. And it's not till your balance systems and your eye movement system are addressed appropriately so that goes away and resolves on own. And it allows the chiropractor, physical therapist, massage therapist, and even the acupuncturist you've been working with to get the results they believe they were capable of helping you do. But do not keep trying without having the full approach because that's the way you get the results ultimately that you want.